Hi, I'm Nancy, Pampered with Diamonds. Today, I have some unboxings to do. I'm going to split this up into two videos, but the first part is going to be the minis. So, as you all know, I'm doing a library event and we're doing Make Market, but I may switch over to the Sweet Treats because they come all packaged up and I'll show you what I'm talking about. So let's dig in. Okay, so our sweet treats, I think that's what they call it. What is it? What's the name of it? Sweet treats. Okay, we get a kit. We get the canvas. This. We get our sticker sheet. We get our thank you. There's nothing in it, just the, if you haven't gotten the barcode for the app, I highly recommend you do that because you get 20% off. And once you purchase from Diamond Art Club, you get to join our Facebook group. And then there's a code in there that you can use all the time. It's not 20%, but it's a pretty good one. So I highly recommend your second purchase, third purchase, go on our Facebook group and give it a try. And here's instructions on how to do diamond art if you've never done it. In our drills. So our tool kit, every kit that you buy Diamond Art comes with some form of a tool kit. Can't get this tool kit out. Okay. All right, you get baggies, baggies in a baggie. I use them to store leftover drills. Extra putty. This will last you a really long time. Preloaded pen of putty. This is going to last you a really long time. To get the cover off, you just pull it. And to get the putty, I don't know if you can see, there's no putty up there yet. But if you just turn this a hair, two hairs, you'll see it'll start coming up. And don't want to turn it any more than that because it, it'll just keep, keep coming out. And then when you take it out, just take it out. And I have put it on the end. I don't recommend that. I'm not really happy with doing it that way. I tried it. I don't really like taking the putty from here and putting it on the end. Some people do it. Now, Diamond Painting Jim has researched this cap. This cap is not here to keep it from drying out. This cap is just to protect the plastic point. So when you're not using it to prevent it from breaking, you keep your cap on. Because I wondered that if that caps to keep it from drying out, why don't we have something for this end? Well, Jim answered that. It's because this is just to protect the tip. Okay. And here's our wax. And here is a seven placer. And a smaller tray. This is a little smaller than the regular trays, but it's still a good one. High sides, a stopper, so you, when you shake your drills out, you won't spill them all over the place. Oof, hope everybody's awake now. Okay, 
So let's put this away. Okay. And let's take a look at these. I'm thinking about doing a kids event after the adult classes are done and doing it with some kids. And I think kids would really like these. Look at that. I just, they look so yummy. Now, the drills. Okay, they come prepackaged per project. Okay, this is the cake. Goes there. This says Halloween trick or treat. I don't know which one that is. So. Let us go on to the next one, which is the Halloween trick or treat. Oh. This is the cupcake. We'll figure it out. We can do this. This is the donut. This is the ice cream. This is the lollipop. All right, this must be the Halloween trick or treat. All right, it's candy, it's chocolate. I get it, but it's literally called Halloween. Can you see that? Halloween trick or treat. So let's see, let's make sure we have the, I'm pretty sure it's correct. So Z. 898 is the letter H. And yes, it's in there. So that's what it is. So when I do the event for the kids, I'm going to be able to say, Sarah, you're doing the lollipop. Here's what you need. And I have extra trays, wax, and pens. So they'll also have that and they'll have everything they need right here. I know it's a lot of waste, but when you're doing it for an event to teach children, I don't consider this a big waste. It's a big help, actually. It's a big help. So that's the sweet treats. And all of these drills are special drills. The first two are A, B's, and all the rest are fairy dust. So this is a super, it's going to be a super cute picture when it's done. And they'll have some nice artwork that they can take home and put in a four by six frame. I really like this. I like it. I like it. I like it. Now, I don't know. Here it is. Okay. And our next one, I don't know if any of you are doing the event with Wendy of um, diamonds and stuff, but I've joined their event for this month. And she's actually giving away one of these. Not this one, but I will show you in a minute. The dragons. She loves dragons. Go check out diamonds and stuff. She's giving this out. I'll go over this kind of quick because she does a thorough explanation of it. 
of an unboxing, but we get your kit. It's got your bag. See, there's the tray, and they are stackable. You get the bags, you get the pen. You can see the pen in there. And you get your card, which we don't have to open. And here are our dragons. And these are all fairy dust for these dragons. Look at that guy. He's going to be all fairy dusted. Super cute. So go check out Wendy and go see those dragons. And again, the reason she likes this too is because they're all kitted up individual and six people one each will win one of the dragons and they're all pre-kitted up. So go check her out. Show her some love. So this is Sweet Treats and the dragons. I already put them away, but it's dragons. I did. I got two boxes of the Sweet Treats so that I can share these with families, children, so to get them to enjoy the hobby. All right. Well, that is all I had for you at the moment. And I will see you real soon. Bye and be kind.